Hi guys, so I'm going to be starting a new series. Um, I was inspired by collegefashion.com. Uh, it's a blog that I go on daily and it just has like lots of fun stuff and I like to read it every day because there's always like fashion advice, college advice. And, and one they had um, the other day, it was um, choosing your own personal style. And um, that just inspired me because, like, a lot of the stuff it said is, like, totally true. Um, I'll link it in the down bar for you guys to look at. Um, and, like, one of the ones that they said was, like, make a style board. And I actually did that, and it's a lot of fun. Um, I, I didn't do it recently. I did it um, a couple months ago for my class because I was in fashion marketing. And we had to do that, but it was the exact same thing, so. That is mine. Um, can you see that? Okay, I have my hand over my name. <laughs> so, it says romantic, and then what you basically did is you just chose, like, um, pictures that you liked and you put it on here. Um, my cat's attacking my foot. Um, so, like, the military look was really in, because I made this in last, like, last fall, I want to say. Um, the military look was really in, and I like that. And I always like the girly look. I always like it. Like, this dress, it is gorgeous. But I'm pretty sure it's, like, really expensive. Um, and I'm, I'm really into, like, these hats I like. I like these for the fall and winter. I wear them all year long. Um, I like this furniture, and I put this on here because it, it says it's a parka, but I think I thought it was more like a raincoat, because I really wanted a raincoat, and I still really want a raincoat. I cannot find one that I like a lot anywhere, um, and I like the Chanel bag, and I just like really girly stuff, like the chandelier. And yeah, so I encourage you guys to make one of these because they make really good, like, wall decorations for, like, your dorm and stuff. Pearly beads. I wasn't actually going to wreck a necklace for this. Um, but yeah, so. And we also had to make one for other people in the class, and I'm not going to show you that one. So I actually gave this to my sister because she wanted to hang it in her room. But there was a really bad thunderstorm. And it fell down, so I was like, oh, I'm going to take that. I'll give it back to you, so I'll probably give it back to her. But she has the other one, but the girl that I styled in my class, like, you basically, like, ask each other questions, like, oh, what's your favorite stores and stuff like that, and what kind of jewelry do you like? Do you like long? Do you like short? Do you like chains? Do you like plastic? Like, just, like, that kind of stuff. And hers was, like, the exact same as mine, basically. So I had to make it look different, but what I did on hers is I made it like this was a different color. Um, I used like purple and blues for like, because it still said romantic because she was the same. Which, I will get to that. Names to describe your style, and there's five of them. And I, mine is romantic because I took this quiz. I don't know if I can show you guys this because this is like my school book. I don't know if that's bad. but. Okay, I will anyway. Um, I won't show you the cover of it, though. It just says, like, your personality cluster, and, like, you just answer these questions. Like, um, like, if that, like, it says, I prefer being active most of the day. Is that true or no? Um, for me, I can't remember what I put because I didn't write it down. But I would say not most of the day. I do like to be active part of the day, but not most of it. But yeah, and you just write yes or no. And then there's like a couple pages. I think there's 50 questions. Yep. And then um, this is like how you score it. Like that. Uh, maybe I'll take a picture of this and put it on my blog so you guys can see it. Yeah, because... Um, yeah, this would be confusing to do over here. But, yeah, so once you decide, like, you're romantic, 
that's like going to be like girly stuff and like chiffon and flowy stuff and you want to stick to wearing that. Um, and then like some of it I don't think is like accurate. Like it says, okay, if you're sporty, you're strong, athletic, casual, and relaxed. Like that's your physical features. That's not necessarily true. Um, same thing with dramatic. You can be short and it says tall, striking features, high fashion. Like, it's not all true. And then, like, this is just for fun. Cars most likely to drive, like, romantic. I would drive a Cadillac. I personally would not drive a Cadillac. I would rather drive, like, a Mercedes Benz because that, that was one of the choices for a classic. Or even a BMW or Ferrari. Not a Jeep. Those are, like, all the choices. Um, and then they just, it just has, like, romantic fashion personality clothing choices, and, like, it was, like, kind of the stuff that I just said, like that. Yeah, you guys should definitely take a fashion marketing class, it's a lot of fun. Um, yeah. And then it says, like, the brands to wear. This is, you don't have to do this if you're rich, you can, but I'm not rich. Like, romantic is, like... Anna Sui, Betsy Johnson, Valentino, Fear Wang. That's all expensive. I can't afford any of that. Um, I'd be better off with the... Yeah, it's all expensive, actually, because it's all, like, designers. And, yeah. Also, I just updated my blog yesterday. Well, actually, it was today, because I did, like, at 3 in the morning. And I did, like, all the fall fashion styles, like and like what I think about them. Yeah, so you can check that out. I'll link that down below too. It's always linked down below, but I'll say new thread. It does say that right now actually, which is not really that new anymore, so. But this one is new, I promise. Um, yeah, so this is just like the intro of like how to choose your style. Like I'm gonna be going over like body shapes and what colors you should wear and like all that fun stuff. But this is just like the intro. I don't know. Maybe I'll film them all today. Probably not. Um, I'm not going to post them all today just because it would just be like blah. I don't know. I feel like it's a lot. And I still need to film my July favorites. So I'm probably going to do that next. Uh, yeah. So I hope you guys understand this um, style thing. It's like about choosing your personal style, finding what it is. I hope you guys understand this. I think it will make more sense when I link down um, the college fashion link down below what they said because um, it's in writing and I guess I'm not very good at explaining things. But yeah, so I'll be going over that kind of stuff and it's all in this book right here that I'm going to be going over because I learned all this stuff and it is so helpful like how to organize your closet and stuff like that. I'm not going to do that because my closet is, I'm not organizing it because I'm moving in fall. Like, no, I'm not moving in fall. I'm moving next month. September 3rd, I'm moving. So I'm not going to organize my closet because I'm going to have to move everything. But I will for dorms when I move in my dorm. And I will do a, probably a thing, um, a tour maybe. I don't know. We'll see how good that goes. Yeah, this is kind of random, but this is just kind of the, take your bell, no! She's scratching at my poster. That's not nice. That's not nice. They hide at a camera. Meow. Meow. I like to hold her like a baby. Yeah. So that's all. I hope you guys um, stay tuned for more of um, the series that I'm doing. Um, I think the next one I will be doing, Owie, is um, what color you are. Yeah. Um, Tinkerbell's getting really antsy, so I'm gonna let her down and go. Okay. Bye!